Welcome back, members of the Wolf here with some more Black Myth Wukong. And now we left off, we fought, I think we fought the frog, and we fought a non white, I believe it was. And we tried to fight the yin tiger, he put hands all over us, so we just. We just stop that because that dude is just something else, man. We'll go back and fight him eventually, but just not right now because I don't know. I'm just not in the mood for him. Like he—he's just so much that it, it deteriorates my soul fighting him. So I'm just not gonna deal with him right now. But I will eventually pop back on him, like real soon. But anyways, let's go ahead and go on. We'll. Before we go that way, because that looks like the path we're supposed to go, we're going to go down here, because you remember we ran around, we found some little paths. So I'm going to run down this way and see what we can come upon. So we went across there, we ran that way. We ran across this way as well, because that's where we hit the... Uh... Can we go up there? So, yeah, it is a place. So, so we hit that shrine. There's a, there's a shrine right there. We hit that shrine. Put this piece of candy up. I guess you can go up too, but we're not gonna go up yet. We're gonna go, we're gonna go, to, go down. So we didn't go all the way down here. We just, we, we just hit that shrine and came back around. Frame dropping. Ooh, I see you. And he got the blue thing around him, so that means he can do a spirit thing. I actually, uh... I haven't fought him since, like... Whoa! Since the very first area? What's going on? I'm moving super slow right now. Okay, that was that wasn't it. Like the frost, even when it after you break out of it, it still made me move super slow. And I've never known him to turn invisible. What I was trying to say is I changed my uh, cloud step to rock steady. I gotta get used to using it a lot more though, instead of dodging, just use my rock steady. But we haven't fought that enemy since like the first zone. And, but now with that, that blue, him being blue like that means he's a spirit to take, so we're about to take his spirit. I hate the fact that you, you, you wake up and automatically get like that. Oh my gosh, bro. I thought he was going to stand down. Okay, either, either way, I still hit that anyway, so it would hit me. I'm just garbage right now. Is that another one coming near me or something? I, I, can, I hear somebody. My frames are going crazy. Oh, him. Yeah. My, my frames are going crazy right here. Alright, let's get back to him in this time. Steady. Had a full charge on it. Yeah, you was. <laughs> you weren't gonna make it out of that. Go ahead and take that spirit. Mm. 
should have been it. Okay. Uh, nothing else over there. I heard somebody waking up. What is going on? My frames right now. A froggy froggy. I heard, I heard you, I heard you. I can hear you, bro. Oh my gosh. Oh, well, I guess I'm going down here. Oh, obviously jumping down there is death. So that's definitely not the way to go. This whole thing is just super open right now. You must, we must supposed to come back here at some point for something because there's no way they would just have this here, this open. Let's teleport to the one across the way, not not the one that has the fox in front of it, but the, the other one. I don't know. I'm not really sure. So this is the one that has the fox in front of it, I think. So uh, let's go to this one. Let me go kill this guy again, just to get some of that experience. You didn't get a chance, bro. You didn't get a chance to do nothing. That's crazy. Alright, so we can run up this way. Get my focus meter back up. We also changed our, uh, oh my gosh, our little things that's in our drink. Because uh, if you remember, I had the one on on that that, uh, that gives you mana when you sip, but I went back and reread it, and it actually only gives you mana or mana when your health is full. So when your health is full and you take a sip, it gives you back mana. Other than that, it does not give you back mana. So I was like, okay, that's not very convenient because... Yeah, it gives you back when your when your health is full, but my health is not always full, so like that's not convenient. I, I need something that every time I sip, I'm gonna get my benefits. Right? Oh snap! I ain't gonna see you right there. None of y'all are. None of y'all have a weapon. So this, this is just free wheel. Do I really need the wheel? No, I think I got like 90,000 wheel right now or something like that. Something crazy. I'm literally just doing this because this is, this is what I would be doing if y'all if if wasn't watching. I don't know why, but it's entertaining. It's the little things. Alright, now let's search around. Make sure we're not gonna miss something miss something that's just out in the way somewhere. Okay, so we can go down there. I was oh, and there's a guy right there. By himself with his hands behind his back. Tied down. That just 
either either he's about to be uh either he, he's about to be um like a a, a secret enemy in the sense of like he's he's, a, he's about to be like elite enemy i mean or either he's about to be a yaguar chief one of the one of the two and I'm, 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 I'm gonna go with yaguar chief i'm searching around a little bit first before i go back up there and fight him yeah, stop there. Well, I think I, I think I might know who that is actually. That's milling down. Let's go ahead and get to him now. All right, let's go ahead and fight him now. Mm -hmm. What's up, bro? Fight! Ooh, he kicked the shit out of me. I thought he was about to flip us. Uh, Mmm, kick me out of the air. Alright, I gotta get back up. I tried to heal. Oh my god, he hit so hard. Ah, I tried to, I tried to mobilize him. Oh, I can't use my Oh, he counts my, mobiliz my, my, my mobilization now. So, oh my gosh, that, that shouldn't have hit me at all. Come on, bro. He, he. He, he cast my mobilization now. Let me hit again. That grab was so fast. Heal. Oh, I tried to rock steady. I tried to rock steady. Heal, 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 heal. Oh my gosh, he knocked me out of it. That's crazy. He is beating the crap out of my dude. I tried to risk it and I knew I was gonna get hit by it. Like Wukong's combos are so long that trying to get that finisher off is just crazy. Like you get knocked out of that finisher so much that doesn't even make sense. And it is so easy to interrupt you in the finisher compared to any of the other creatures doing their finisher, whatever case it be, like you 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 rarely interrupt them. But it's so easy for you to get knocked out of your finisher when you're doing it. All right, let me see if I can get my focus back. You definitely want to save immobilization anything for the, the second part of him. His second phase, because his first phase is, I wouldn't say easy, but it's significantly easier than his, his second phase, obviously. And we probably could have beat him if we'd have if we'd have prioritized better.
come on, bro. That's so food. That, that, that's so foolish. It makes no sense. Like, the, the fact that he's able to knock me out of that so easily makes no sense. Oh my gosh, the enemy hit me with that one. Right, we almost beat him without freaking using no heals. I'll skip that, skip it again. Drop for that grab. That's not what I meant to do. Oh well, that's just fucking minute. Immobilization. He legit like buff through all. I don't know if y'all noticed that, but all his attacks just hit right through all everything that we was doing. Get out of there. Oh, I, I, I did block it there. Still got my transformation too. Bye-bye. You got me once, but you ain't getting me twice. Non-able. What kind of name is that? You're not able to beat me. That's what you are. Alright. Let me smack that shit up. Oof. That was a little fight. That was a little fight right there. Got my, got, my, got my blood a little tingly. Got my blood a little tingly. Yeah, that was good. That was good. I like that. I like that. Whew. Oh man. Alright. Yeah, 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 my blood a little tingly down there. Snap my neck a little bit. <sighs> yeah, it really keeps the people going. I still think that spirits I was open a spirit ship we can give me my uh, my mana back. It, it, it just only seems right. But there's no, there's not nah, what I'm thinking about. Like, there's no way to recover your mana in this game other than like putting that uh that that little seed thing on that makes it so when your health is full, you recover mana. And then resting. That's the only ways that I see that you can recover your mana. Unless unless I'm missing something, that, which I 100% could be. Okay, this is the way this this connects right back over here. So we finish that whole path. I see him hanging there, by the way. I couldn't hit him. I tried. Alright. So. Let's keep going. So we went all the way down now. We hit this way, went all, this, this takes us all the way back around. We went down, we found a secret area thing down there, but we can't do anything at it. Oh, what's this? But we can't do anything at it yet, because it's a part of a quest line that we haven't unlocked yet. So let's go back to where we... What the? I almost fell off. Let's go to where we're actually supposed to go to. Which was... Wait, up, up this way. What's it? Wait, there's one of them slam down things over here. I didn't, I didn't go to no, no. Oh, you thought you had me. You thought you had me. You thought you did. Honestly, you almost did, so nah, I, ain't, I ain't gonna cry. I need to give me the second fight. Because you just swing right through my attacks. My attack is not strong enough to stop you from swinging. Like, just don't 
interrupt anything. All right, where's the fox guy? Right here. All right, let me let me get my uh, let me get my mana back because I don't know what's gonna be coming next. So let's get let's get some mana back. Let's rest right quick. All right, I'm gonna kill this guy up here just because he's here. You're too close, bro. I, I just gotta kill you. Just that, get that. Good experience. There you go. I'm working on getting pluck a mini level up, level all the way up. Kind sir, pause your steps and heed That's my the, story. That's the worst secondary thing to To become one of the humans. One day, I was foraging for food and found myself caught in a hunter's trap. Yeah, it is. A young scholar saved me. Mm -hmm. and Telling the same story. To let me hear. I couldn't move, yet my heart swelled with gratitude. I thought I could aid him in his career in return for saving my life. Little did I foresee that following a dream, he would take my life. My soul lingered, yet he left without a trace. I sought tirelessly, only to find he had become a monk in the new Thunderclap temple. I beg you, sir, to take my fur and wear my form. Come for me and calm my sorrowful heart. The stop animation fox He's didn't look hiding. like this. In the side hall of oh, the my, hold on, my chair just snapped back. I hate when it does this. You lead me to him? For some reason, my chair will, my gaming chair will, uh, like, while I'm sitting in it, will just stop being a gaming chair. <laughs> if it makes sense. Man, I know that doesn't make sense, but it'll, it'll just, like, snap back, basically. It's this way. Have we been this way? Was, was this where the fox was at? Yeah, uh, I think this is where, this is where the uh, frog was at. I don't know. Yeah, it is. It is where the frog was at, but I don't remember. Come on, I must have backtracked myself back around. That's why. Cause I, I didn't remember running past that to get up there. Whoa, my frames is going crazy. How do how do we do transformation? I. I Run around a lot later. You transform, I don't care. I can run around a lot later and do that. You know me, I don't want to miss any experience. Let me go back and kill everything. Come on down here. Why did, why did you do your attack? Probably get one the ability to chance something to them too. Let's let's just make sure we go back because I think that's where we fought the frog at, but at the same time I don't remember going past the fox to fight the frog. But I could be wrong. I could be very, very wrong. I just don't remember going past the fox to fight the frog. So let's make sure this area is not just a it's not just something else here that I just missed. Frames is going bananas, bro. I'm just dropping. It must, it must be. Because I do remember going through this, though. I do remember. I remember, I remember going through there, there was some wheel to take right here. Oh, it, it, took, it took us back here. It teleported us when we were back here. Okay, yeah, that is right. Because it, it was right before we got to this. It was right before we got to this. So that, 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 that is correct. The, pot, the, the frog was right there. 
That was just the other entrance. Oh, shit. Thing is, now, if I remember right, I think you can you can transform back to the fox whenever you need to. So, don't be too worried about missing out on that. And I'm not saying missing out on it because you can still miss out on it. But don't be too worried about like, oh, I have to stay the fox the whole time and run around. No, 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 no. You can transform back to the fox. That 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 brush thing that she gave us. Where is it at? Inventory. This brush thing right here. The lingering uh, resentment of the deceased white fox transforms through her, her fur into this brush. So, transfers into her, from her fur to the brush. You got me. Yeah, you got me in it. Interrupting me. I appreciate that. I'm sure I'm about to do some wheels somewhere anyway, so I don't mind using a little bit of heels. Yep. I do like the fact that, 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 that that's in the game. Like, you're able to get your heels back. Like, that's pretty dope. Like, I, I love my Souls Lights, and I, I love the Elden Ring mechanic type thing. Uh, you can get your Estus Flask back if you kill, like, a group of areas. I mean, a group of areas. Uh, if you kill a group of enemies, basically, that's all, like, one group. You get your Flask back. A couple of Flasks back. After killing them. I, I think that's pretty dope, because... Obviously, you, you just be roaming around areas for, for long periods of time. Oh my gosh. You be roaming around areas for long periods of time in that game. So it's like, uh, I don't have any heals left. And the only way I can heal is if I, if I sleep. And if I sleep, all the enemies recover. Like, games like that, they should 100% have a way. The hell was that? Some, somebody's hanging. Yeah, I knew it. I heard him giggle. I was hoping you was gonna be fake. But uh games like that Fire. Where's he at? I'll see it in a second. But uh if it's if games like that, if they're gonna have that type of mechanic that they 100% need a way that you can recover your health, your heals. Like, if, you, if you're going to give me a candle, every time I, I rest, all the enemies come back. But the only way I can get my heals back is by resting. It's like, okay, you, you kind of, yeah, you made it. So it's like, okay, you better be better at managing your health, man. You better be better at actually playing the game. It's like, yeah, but it's like, is that the only way you want the game to be played? Or do you want to actually look at the game in a sense of, like, how do I make characters, yeah, get better at the game, but still not punishing them for not being good at the game? Because, in a sense, we've ever been this way before. All right, let's go back up here and kill that guy that was standing over here. In a sense, you're kind of punishing your characters for not being good at the game by making it so the only way you can get your health, uh, get your health replenished is by resting. But every time you rest, you also uh, recover and make all, every enemy in the area come back. So it's like, okay. Now I'm, I'm stuck making the hard choice of just running around and not, and just like hoping I don't die and losing all my progress and getting sent back to the hell thing and it's the, the next shrine, bonfire, whatever it may be. Or you do something like this. Oh snap, I can get my Estus Flash back by killing a group of enemy. Oh snap, I can get my health and stuff back by absorbing will. He's to my left side. I can I can hear the uh, in my headphones. I can hear it. It's closer towards my left. I say this music playing as if somebody's about to be so crazy. Ouch! Oh, I don't even see you right there. There's a snake that would have bit me. I don't know if y'all ever heard that saying before, but if it's a snake, it would have bit you. That's something that my mom and them used to say all the time when I was growing up. I think it's a, a big country thing. Oh, wow. Got me out in the last part like that? Oh, 
I know his attacks well enough to know when I'm supposed to be dodging. I need to heal. I don't know his attacks at all to know when I'm supposed to be dodging or when I'm supposed to be getting out of the way or what. So I'm just getting whipped. Alright, just stop. Just stop. You're doing way too much. That was way too much of me getting beat up. Alright, I do know from watching people play that that the uh, I do need to change something right quick. So let me change my demobilization spell to Ring of Fire because I know I need it for this next thing that's coming up. This is. I don't know where he's at for sure, but I know he must be around here because I can hear him. Alright, he's definitely close. Uh, so yeah, I, say, I, I can I can hear him in my headphones way better. I love these headphones because they're directional in a way, so like while I was turning away from him, I was hearing the headphone where he's close to. Hold on. Here. Oh, fire. I need fire. Oh. See, that's the old dude. So, from what I know, I use Ring of Fire. I heard that Buddha planted watermelons here hundreds of years ago. One bite grants prolonged life. Yet, when the cold bites all around, without your powerful spells, uh, there's no way I can find it. Someone once saw a chubby boy jump from the cliff with a watermelon in his arms. He rushed to the edge of the cliff but saw no movement down there. Seemed like certain death. Suddenly, he heard the boy laughing from beneath, on and on. Bewildered, he fled from the cliff. This story may offer a clue for my treasure hunt. Maybe the watermelons were planted under the cliff. Don't let me keep you, sir. I will leave by myself when I feel warm enough. All right, I'm gonna go change my spell back then. Take my little little trot. I don't know if I need this sand thing anymore, even anyway. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, why my health so low? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I didn't know you was right here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill out, everybody. Chill out. Stop, chill out. What is going on? First of all, why, why am I getting hit so much by y'all? Okay. I'm gonna heal again. I don't know why I just ran around in a circle like that, but I did. Look around the area. 
Hold on, let me change this because I don't really think I need to move, put this one back on. I don't know if I need that one right now either, but I'm going to just change it. I know some frogs around here. It has to be. I knew it. Whenever, whenever it's one of these little areas like this, there's always some, some frogs here. Some of these little croakers. And just one. Come on, bro. Stop. Like, for real, getting hit by them just feels disrespectful because they're such low, low enemies. Low rank Yagwais that just getting hit by them, is, uh, it, it, it more so annoys me than anything. Because as you, you would think, like, since this game doesn't really, it has armor and stuff in it, but, like, not really. Like, it does, it doesn't. You would think, like, getting hit by these lower level enemies, like, wouldn't do so much damage to you, and they still do. made out okay I think this is the that's the path that we went to for the frog I believe so let's go this way I like how when I'm playing the game like my mind is so into it that I'm leaning my head to the side like I'm going to see better or something like that. Knowing good and well, I'm not going to be able to see better. But my, for some reason, my my instinct is to leave my head, lean my head to the side to see if I see better. We haven't got a poison weapon, now I think about it. And I, and I love poison weapons. We haven't gotten a single poison weapon in this game. What's up, Insane Gaming? What and sing streaming my bus. I don't know why I read it that way. Here we go. Big mill. Alright, so that's not actually a way to get up there, I don't think, is it? Let me see if I let me jump up there. This game, nah. It 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 it, it immediately puts put the force on me. Ah, uh, you know, not much. We just uh hitting us up. Is today Saturday? Is, is today Saturday? Is today Sunday? For me. It, oh, it's, it's Saturday back in the States, for sure. It's Sunday, Sunday for me, though. Sunday for me. Yeah, we can go that way. So that that's the end of this path. Back in Cali. So we ran all over. Mm, my voice is cracking nerves. And we ran all over that place. Let's go. Now that guy right there, I think that might have been like the last part of his quest line. Not like the last part, like it's over. Like the last part in. Now we can go. Man, that Frank, that skip was crazy. Okay, so this ring of fire doesn't work like that. Ring of fire when I'm here. It's, it's supposed to be uh, up my focus and stuff like that, but it doesn't do what it's supposed to do since it's quest related. So we must supposed to go this way to progress onward. I don't know why I just spoke that slow. We haven't seen one of those fake ones in a minute, the fake ginseng and stuff like that. So we could have we can't could have came down this path, but we didn't. We went down this way, went around. This looks like it's going to nothing as well. So. We, one of these is fake. I knew it. I knew. I knew one of them was gonna be fake. Hell, two of them might be fake. Oh my gosh! I was not expecting that. Let me tell you that. And that's what I said.
cook, boy. Oh, I got a stand You're so dead. So dead. But I had no stamina. Oh, I got a cape. I'm gonna go ahead and heal myself back up. My health is gonna take some hits right quick. I figured only like like two of them gonna be fake. Oh my gosh. I swear, unlocking that 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 technique so that I can uh, continue my combo on, even when I like rolling stuff, was was one of the best things to do because, man, does that save you a lot. What's this? Stop! Pick it up. A drink, Jade Essence. Okay, now let's go ahead and pick this up. Jensen got that cape thing from him, which I don't know what that cape does. Let me see. It's probably not that strong either. It's not that strong. Uh, but it mildly increases our stamina. Whoops, didn't need to do that. Um, uh, let's see some stuff we got. We got a, this new drink, the Jade Essence Sips recovers 36% of maximum health and moderate amount of mana. We were just talking about how recovering mana. And this has two things on it. So I, this is this moderately increases our movement speed by drinking this one but it has tree and this has two with mana that's probably that's obviously way better because of that the mind like yeah increase my movement speed is cool but that's my movement speed this gives me more mana back and we, we need mana to cast any spells and i'm sure if i upgrade it i can get it to tree or whatever it case may be or to give you even more mana back so definitely gonna mess with that uh, i'm not worried about the journal right now i'll do the journal on my off time stuff what well, I'll do at the end of this, I'll do a little read of, of everybody's little uh, story thing. I might start putting that towards the end of the chapter. The end of each chapter, do a little read about like all the enemies, the Yagwai chiefs, Yagwai kings, and lesser Yagwai of that area. All right, so this this went all the way around and back and like and just went to kind of nothing. So there, there's obviously another path that I missed that we need to go to. Probably, I'm, I'm nowhere near surprised on if I did miss it because this area is freaking huge. But it's been fun. It's been really fun because there's so much to do in this area. Like I can only imagine the next area being even bigger, chapter four. Because this chapter three area is all right. All right we've definitely been here because we got this stuff. And this leads back up. Um, I'm, I'm a little confused only because. I must have went a, a different way out than I was supposed to go. So I'm going to go back towards the box opening. Go back. Ah, yeah, we're probably supposed to go this way. I think we went down there, but we're probably supposed to go this way. Yep. Yep. There we go. We're back on track now. So. Oh, that's it. When we get to the next uh, shrine, we're gonna teleport to that 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 uh, area that was beneath us because I think that's where the the uh, treasure hunter quest goes next. And if 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 that's true, then obviously we're gonna go fight that treasure hunter uh, quest thing, uh, whatever it is. Whoa, that's, I don't know why that scared me like I was going to be able to fall off when this game doesn't let you fall off anything, but I still don't trust it. Like, I feel like I can still fall off. So we haven't seen, uh, like, a monster come from these, from these Jintan. We've seen the Jinsing monster. We've seen, like, the mushroom head monster, the flat mushroom head monster, and, like, the round mushroom head monster. But we haven't seen the thing come from the other thing. Like, and I, I would like to see that. A loyal friend or Ooh, 
we got Kuryo. And that's the thing too, like a lot of enemies can give you Kuryos, but it's a it's, it's a RNG thing, so I don't I don't know exactly which enemies can. Some of it just is by by it's a, you're supposed to get it. But a lot of these curios too. Let me. What was this one? Let me see this monk. What he did? What was that? Did he just block? Take the form of non enables. Let loose a fury of punches and kicks. Different phases of light attacks enable different uh, moves. He didn't do anything though. Slightly increases the attack, critical hit chance, and critical hit damage, but massively reduces your your uh, maximum mana. That's not cool. Mildly increases the maximum health of summoned minions. Take the form of the old ginseng guai. Take root to call forth one or more ginslings that strike the foe. So you basically just call it little dudes. See, see this thing already got the upgrade. It increases your, it slightly increases defense by upgrading it. I think I'm, I, I, I actually can upgrade this like to a higher level, like to the last level, I believe. Take the form of a crow diver. Scatter the feel of frigid dust. Form an incense burner. Uh, stacking frostbane on both you and your foes. Well, that just doesn't sound pleasant for me at all. Okay, let me, let's look at this curio. The new one we got, it uh, slightly increases the four bane resistance. Okay, that's nothing. That's nothing noteworthy. Alright, let's go on. I, I don't see the little bling 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 shrine thing, so. <laughs> Big old guy over there, and then another one of these frog dudes here. I said frog. Come on. Still hit me. You about to fall over? Oh, you fell over. Oh, you did not fall over. But you did fall over, but not how I thought you was gonna fall over. You so dead. I got a problem with mocking stuff like sound effects and uh, accents and stuff like that when I when I hear them. That's why I hate talking on the phone to people with a different accent because unknowingly sometimes I will mock that accent. Like I'm I am in no way trying to be an asshole, even though some people probably still heard this and be like, yeah, you're just an asshole, bro. And yeah, it's probably true, but. I am not consciously doing it on purpose. My brain just automatically does it. And I don't know what the hell it is. And it's been since I was a kid. Ooh, I did not see this up here, but I'll take it. Let me go ahead and heal. Take this. Now it makes me want to jump on the roof and make sure I ain't missing nothing. Okay, so can't go over there probably. Let's go back to this other side of the roof. I know the jump, the jump but don't even let me jump across there. Like, my, my boy is a monkey and he has no ups. He, he has no jumps for distance or none of that. Like, if he was in a, if he was in a long jump, nah. Triple jump, nah. Not even a high jump, my boy. And he's a monkey. Oh, yeah, about 50 minutes into this video. That's fine. We put two. Oh, what's up? Or two different bosses in this video so far, which is fine. Um, thought I heard the yellow thing from, uh, I did. 
the yellow thing from the uh, shrine. Alright, so we got a shrine right up there. Which we're gonna go get, but let's let me wander this area first. It's a whole path over here. This is a whole different path. It's a whole different path over here. It's crazy. Like, I wasn't expecting that. I thought I was about to just walk this way and there's gonna be like a little cutoff area or something like that. And there's a whole different path over here. Okay, this this is gonna be some aspiration for another point. Oh, that's that's where we're down there. We're gonna continue with the what what I said we was gonna do the first time, because if I start wandering around like crazy, this is gonna be a two hour video. There's a tread chest over there. Like I, I, I just, I just want to get that. I have to get it. There, I knew it. I knew he was gonna wind up flying in the air, bro. As soon as I wanted to hit him, I should. That's what I should have did. The wish him call it instead. I should. What the hell is that? Okay. I should have did the. Uh, uh, pillow stance. Ouch. Alright, I don't know what that is, but there's potentially another boss. save that we're gonna go to the shrine oh my gosh this guy's here we're gonna save that too because what we plan on doing anyways is teleporting out of this area when we teleport out of this area it's gonna bring everything back to life anyway instead of grabbing that we might need it later so let's just get ourselves to the shrine oh my gosh not yet Oh my gosh, he's eating me up. Fall down. I hope you stay dead. Alright, let's, let's hit the shrine. That that area right in front of us is so open too that it, it seems like another boss could be right there in that area. Alright, now let's travel to is this what it is the watermelon field i think that's what it is, what it is. Right, let's travel to the watermelon field i think that's what it is and let's see because i think that was the end of that guy's quest i think so i think it was only just like a, a little two-part quest i think that was the end of it Yep, we got a cutscene. Time and again, I tested you, and I saw nothing but gullible goodness. <laughs> Our brother does misjudge as well. It requires no effort to trick you. You will never be the destined one. Let me help you end your sorry life. It's that old man, I think. Oh my gosh. It's gonna... Okay, bro, use mobilization. All my brain just get all over the place. Oh, 
Oh, shit. I'm dead. I'm not dead, but I, I tried to heal right in and there. Come on, bro. Right when I, every time I'm trying to heal, you he, he gonna keep doing it? Although it doesn't take my stamina away, it, I mean, it is. Although it doesn't take my, my mobilization away from me, I mean, my uh, actual use of the way, it's still. Oh my gosh. Of course, of course, of course, why wouldn't it? Why, why wouldn't it hit me as soon as I'm trying to use it? I swear, bro, Wukong takes so long to use his all, all of his stuff that it, it doesn't even make sense. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh my gosh. Please. Oh, I got, I, I finally used it. I said, oh my God, bro. Like, please do what I want you to do. Oh wow, he broke out of that so quick. That doesn't even make any sense. Him again or something? Foolhardy, nothing more. I've done as our brother asked. Till we meet again. Oh, and the fuel got back up. has led you here. <laughs> Rest easy. You won't find those noisy chantings and pain screamings here. Hmm. <sighs> A nice ripe melon. than you think. Sun Wukong used it to trick that disciple of mine. Oh, Will tried to offer me a bite out of something that he already took a bit out of, a bite out of. <laughs> tried, to, tried to offer me some watermelon that he already took a bite out of. Now you've found this place, I'll teach you a trick neither of them knows. Your hand. Spellbinder. Bind spells, vessels, transformations, and soul skills to enhance attack. Focus solely on martial arts. <sighs> Spellbinder. It hurts no foe, but binds yourself. You'll come to understand its use. An old friend of Sun Wukong came to me, wanting some peace. 
I led him to the Great Pagoda. Have you paid him a visit? <laughs> they say you are the destined one. But if destiny is set, what difference do our actions make? Alright, tele teleport me out of this area, probably. Oh, no. Teleport itself out of the area. And the watermelons are gone. Bruh, I didn't even get to try a watermelon. I guess that counts as a as a win. Anything else around here though? Alright, there's nothing. Alright, we're gonna go back to the area we just came from then. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Don't let me close one more door. Alright, now back at the longevity road from the village of ecstasy. This is where we're gonna call it that cuts for anybody that's on YouTube. If you give your boy a like, you know what I mean? Subscribe. If you're not subscribed, little comment never hurts nobody. And uh, you know. I'll catch you in the next one.